Hi, my name is Devdat Patnaik. Today we will go on a journey to discover the history of mythology. In today's episode, we'll focus on Shiva, the family man. We all know Shiva as the destroyer. He's the hermit who's covered with ash and walks in feudal grounds. But he's also shown as a family man with his wife, his sons, and all of them with their vahans. Shiv Parivar is a very popular poster art. But when did this image first appear? We have all heard of the seal from Mohenjo-daro that some people associate with Shiva. It is called the Pashupati seal, surrounded by wild animals, seated in the yogic posture. But there is no family there. That was over 4,000 years ago. Then around 2,000 years ago in the Kushan period, we find images of a four-armed god holding a trident and having three eyes associated with Shiva. Even here, there is no family. The first time we see Shiva with a family is perhaps in the Shatrugneshwar temple in Odisha in the 6th century. So roughly 1500 years ago, when temples are being built in Odisha, you find this image of Shiva with Parvati, with Ganesha, with Kartikeya, and their respective Vahans, the bull Nandi, the tiger, Ganesha's rat, Kartikeya's peacock. In Elora and in Elephanta, we find images of Shiva and Parvati as a married couple. So the idea of Shiva as a householder starts emerging 1500 years ago. By the 10th and 11th century, you have images in Kashmir showing Shiva as a family man. In medieval times, we start finding miniature paintings showing the Shiv Parivar doing ordinary things like sitting around the fire, telling each other stories. It becomes an image of domestic bliss, very different from the single solitary hermit god called Rudra of the Vedas. In these images, even though Shiva is a householder, he retains his hermit side. He's still covered with ash, he still wears animal hide, he still likes to be left alone. And this is visible in these images. What is important to remember is the transformation of Shiva from hermit to householder was in many ways a reaction to the monastic orders where householders were becoming hermits. And therefore these images appear in the 5th century when the Puranic traditions are rising and the old Buddhist and Jain practices are on the way. And this transformation of Shiva over space and time is absolutely amazing.